week I want to talk a little bit about um, going into springs work here in northern North Dakota. Our soil temps aren't that warm yet, so we're not in a huge hurry to plant. We're just kind of putting on our fertilizer. We fertilize a lot of our grass crops, which would be wheat, barley, uh, some of our canola. What we fertilize with is anhydrous ammonia, and this is what the granular fertilizer looks like. It gets put down at a rate separate from um, the tank of anhydrous, which you can see um, is what I pull behind that. And then we are just putting on a lower rate this year um, of both the granular and the anhydrous. Anhydrous ammonia that we put down is what we call water loving. And so it's going to cling to water molecules that are in the soil and stay there. Sometimes why we don't put our anhydrous down in the fall is because it will cling to that water and we are in a very high water table location. And so the anhydrous will move with the water. And so we do not want that. We want it to stay put. Well, if there is no water in the soil, that anhydrous isn't really going to cling to anything. So that's why I said, again, we've lowered our rates considerably. The use of the liquid anhydrous compared to the granular form varies because with the granular form, you have to add another step. That granular even though it's sitting um, either on top of your soil when it's spread or incorporated into the soil, um, like I do with our applicator, it's gonna need water still to dissolve that granular down. So that's why uh, we usually put a mix of both. If there is any moisture in the soil right now, that liquid anhydrous is gonna cling to what little water is there. But again, um, decreased rates because there's not a lot of moisture and so you're not seeing as, as many anhydrous tanks going. We still are a little early compared to normal because again, we didn't get any snow. Um, we didn't have that cover to soak into the ground and usually we are behind and not seeding. A lot of guys have seed in the ground right now. We are just starting our anhydrous because our soil temps are only still around 40 degrees. We just keep waiting for that shot of rain uh, that we don't keep getting. <laughs> so like we say, just pray for rain and we're going to need it. Uh, even once we get the crop in the ground, uh, it's going to need it to germinate. Plants need seed, soil, sun, and water. So we can provide the seed in the soil, but it's up to the good Lord above to provide us with the sunshine and the water.